Hello everybody, this is Clint Locklear from Wolfer Nation. Uh, I am up here with a good friend of mine and I'm out running around checking some bobcat traps with him. I'm not checking, but I come up here to get some some fresh northern air and th this is not like anything that I see in Tennessee. This is really cool. But uh, Jeff has got a set right here that the why why do you think this is a good location because it's got me excited and i ain't got no traps out well the, uh this is just a big otter toilet going through here because like you said we're trapping oh i'm all trapping bobcats he can't get a license here for that um just to clarify but uh this is a big otter toilet and there's lots of rats in the area you can see the you hear the geese and the swans of good food source and then there's, with the otter toilet here there's a lot of smell and them cats just been working through here and the coyotes and the cats will run down this ice and uh you know it's just a, a perfect spot it's a funnel point for them it's a point so when they're running down the ice they'll they're when they're they're just focusing even if they don't know they're doing it they're focused on the point and they'll hit the point and work into it and uh they're just awesome spots what i like about it like i said we, we don't we don't have marshes anything like this but this edge you have these little islands that come out this seems like everything would come check everything out they do they filter down in because uh you know this is where the otter toilets are with all the smell like there's a big rat house right here you know so it just uh you know spots and i've this used to be a, a boat launch when i was just a little boy right over here there was a boat launch and there was no cattails here it was all dug out uh the feds that would had dug this out and the uh brown trout would come up into here and we used to uh snag them we weren't supposed to snag them but you know i think the statute the, of limitations, the statute of limitations run out. <laughs> i was about eight years probably five six eight years old or you could have just dreamed that you did that oh, i could have dreamed that i did it and uh i didn't do anything my dad made me do it mm. <laughs> but you know we used to uh, catch them right over here and you know so the spot has a lot of history for me i like trapping down here and uh this was the first spot my me and my grandson never put in otter sets. We didn't catch nothing because people wouldn't quit spring bringing our sets. But uh, I, I like I like this spot. So. so so what are you doing there, Jeff? Just a got a walk through set. They uh, just give them a platform to come through on. I had some feathers here, but uh, a possum or coon come up and shredded everything. I caught a possum here two days ago, and then uh, I like it because it's got this bush here to put. You know, they either got a step on the outside and not even come in or if they do commit they're going to commit to that inside and uh right here's the playground right here so but, uh, i like them types of sets with the walkthrough i'll make different different ones i'll make a trench set walkthrough i'll make uh you know uh brush pile walkthroughs i like walkthroughs for cats a lot it gives them a gives them a path and uh that's good good sets Good eye 